In our previous video, we learned about the importance of fire divisions on ships and how they help protect the vessel and its crew during fire emergencies. Unlike most structures ashore, ship compartments are more or less isolated against the surrounding environment. Thus, we have quite a chance to keep oxygen out of a compartment in the case of fire and the fire inside the compartment so it cannot spread to other parts of the vessel. In some cases, we might even be able to extinguish a fire just by isolating it from the inflow of fresh air. Airtight isolation will always be our first line of defense in case of a fire on board. However, during normal operation, we need fresh air inside the ship spaces for maintaining a comfortable and safe environment for everyone on board, keep the engines running, and maintain proper cargo care. That is why ventilation ducts are fitted in all compartments where fresh air is needed. However, during a fire, this ventilation system can also serve as a pathway for supplying the fire with oxygen and flames and smoke spreading rapidly. That's where the fire flaps and dampers come in. These components are strategically placed within the ventilation ducts and bulkheads to prevent the fire from spreading to other compartments. Let's start with fire dampers. As per SOLAS regulations, dampers must be installed within all ventilation ducts penetrating any Class A compartment. When a fire occurs, the heat-sensitive element in the fire damper detects the rise in temperature and promptly closes the damper blades, effectively blocking the passage between compartments. Moreover, dampers can also be operated manually from both sides of the fire division bulkhead. Fire dampers are indicated in the fire and safety plan by this icon. These icons might also be used to label dampers and closing devices on site. The icons for dampers and other closing devices are color-coded depending on the kind of space they serve. For accommodation spaces, we use a blue color and the letter A. Machinery spaces are indicated in green and cargo spaces in yellow. Fire flaps and other closing devices are fitted in all inlets and exhaust outlets of the ship's ventilation system to prevent the supply of fresh air to any compartment on fire. Flaps are simple hinge plates that can close off a ventilation inlet or outlet. They are secured with winged bolts to keep the flap in the closed position. Flaps are indicated by this icon and color-coded in the same way as the icons used for dampers. Mushroom heads on deck are fitted with closing devices operated by levers or wheels. All closing devices must clearly be marked with an indication showing their open and closed position, usually indicated with the letters O and C or the words open and close. Flaps, dampers and ventilation fans can be remotely operated. Control stations for remotely operated devices are indicated by this triangular icon. Inside the triangle, the type of device controlled by the respective station is indicated. Let us summarize. In this basic safety training video, we explored the critical role of fire flaps and dampers in safeguarding ships during fire emergencies. Ship compartments are isolated against the environment, making airtight isolation the first line of defense in the case of fire. However, during normal operation, ventilation ducts are essential for maintaining a comfortable environment. Fire flaps and dampers are strategically placed in ventilation systems and bulkheads to prevent fire and smoke spread. Fire dampers, indicated by specific icons, must be installed in all ventilation ducts penetrating Class A compartments. These dampers close automatically when detecting heat, blocking passage between compartments. They can also be operated manually. Fire flaps are simple hinge plates that close ventilation inlets or outlets and are secured by winged bolts. Both flaps and dampers are marked with icons and color-coded based on the spaces they serve. Some devices, including flaps, dampers and ventilation fans, can be remotely operated from control stations indicated by triangular icons with device details. Understanding these components and icons is crucial for effective firefighting and safety on board. Stay informed, stay safe, 